Hello everyone and welcome back to the Hardcore series. It's been a long, long time since I've uh, done the series. It's it's actually probably been a good month or two since I've done uh, the previous episode. And you know what? It feels weird and kind of nice to be back and it's already night time. So we will go to sleep, close that up, and just sleep over here for now. Yes, but we're going to sleep over here. And um, what I'm going to say is basically it's been so long. It's actually... It's, it's been a while actually since I've played Minecraft in general survival. I've generally been playing a lot of creative as I'm back at work now due to um, having you know a full-time job as well as doing YouTube on the side. It's quite a lot of um, a lot of a lot of effort to do uh, but I do enjoy doing YouTube and it's good fun so I'm going to keep it up and continue doing it. It's more of a hobby than anything right now and I love it. It's uh, It's just been awesome the experience of the growth and everyone in the community has been so nice so it's been a nice experience i'm just trying to get familiar with the world again um so i remember we started up here came down the staircase we've got a little path going down here we've got a sheep farm in here which how's that doing probably yeah it's doing okay just the two um we could oh hello there mr zombie we probably could upgrade that at some point uh, we make a full large scale sheep farm we got this building which actually how <laughs> just has um, never warts farm in it so I can sit in this in AFK and get never warts but I'm going to remove that from this at some point and I'm going to make some better farms and bigger farms and uh, there's, a, there's a creeper over there um, and then we got the farm over here which I remember creating if I remember correctly we still have the chicken coop underneath um, fun story actually when I loaded into this world first I um where's all my food did I put it in the chest Last uh, when I loaded into this world I actually uh, came over here and half this was burnt down due to lightning again which if you haven't watched the one of my god it must have been when I first built the big sheep farmhouse uh, that happened before where it all got burnt down and I wasn't particularly happy yeah so it happened again um, the chicken farm obviously was brand new so it probably isn't um, producing too much I haven't really been on to allow it to produce things um, just for now it's gonna look horrendous but we're gonna just have to put this here so I can get out there we are and then back up here um, and we should be good around here yep perfect uh, let's get the dirt and get back out and then we're gonna head over to the board from here and uh, we'll begin filling in the board I've got a few more suggestions and I've got a lot of suggestions by one person um, but I'll probably put a few of them on there and let some others put some on there I'm not sure how I'm gonna roll with it but yeah it's good to be back let's head over there now so I'm over at the uh, little board of magnificence, I don't know what I'm going to call it, the uh, the board of jobs to do. Things to do, jobs done, I don't know, things to do, jobs done, I, I'm just terrible at naming things, let's put it that way. But we've got some more to add to our little board here, um, it's quite close to this building, I might move it back at some point. Um, but for now we've got uh, build a defence wall, which was by Avinash, Avinash Joshi? I'm just going to call you Joshy because I'm not sure I'm going to completely butcher this part of your name. Um, so I just call you Joshy. And uh, I got a bunch of suggestions from Plant Sora. Um, so let's add in a few of these. I'm not going to add in all of them. I'm going to add in a few and uh, try and keep a bit of space on this board. So one of the first things was uh, collect villagers. We need to get some villagers uh, for trades is what he put. Uh, for trade is not what he put. There we are. Well, they put, should I say. Uh, and then we'll put their name just so there we are collect some villagers for trades uh, and create a collect or create collect I'm going to put collect and create a b hive slash house so yeah that'll do oh, that's a nice little thing to put in there uh, and that's by plants or two I'm just trying not to uh, butcher your name and try and get it right. He did actually, add, or they did actually add a lot more to this list. So uh, I'll read some out now. One of them was uh, build a greenhouse as well. So we could definitely do that. I might build a greenhouse, have the bees in the greenhouse, um, and they can help kind of produce more things. Uh, create an enchanting house. Right now we've currently got the basic house um, right at the top. My first ever start house, which we can definitely transform uh, and move the enchanting table out there and we'll get a new a tower down here somewhere which is going to take ages to build so i've got a build for that but i need the resources and i know the resources are going to be hard to get um so we need to do that uh obviously we need to beat the end dragon at some point create a watchtower create an enchanting house i think i just read that one chicken coop we've kind of got a chicken coop over there now we've got the chicken coop uh it's underground so what i want to do is kind of feed up into the little barn section there 
where I can collect the food from, or the um, chicken. Um, what else have we got? Create a mushroom house to place uh, and make food like stew. Uh, create a fish pond and a dock. And uh, yeah, that is a few of his suggestions. I've put a few on the board or there. I don't want to say him because he might be so... <laughs> you don't know on the internet who's who and some people do get quite offended by it. So try to not specify here. But yes, anyway, we'll continue on this. I need to make a pathing to this house as well, which I might actually do now. Uh, create some path, leads up to here, maybe over there. Fill up with a bit of trees so we got some more space. Um, path up this as well. And then we maybe throw down some uh, another build at some point. Need to fill up the gaps. So what I'm going to do right now is probably chuck it into a nice sort of time lapse of me just kind of decorating the area and filling in all this mess that we got going on here. Um, that's just quite a bit of it. So yeah, I'll see you guys in a bit. So after that little time lapse, I feel like this is looking a lot better. We got a nice little path here and already I forgot to add in the nice little slab stairs here so we can go up and down quite easily. Uh, but yeah, it's nice and nice over here. And the only thing I need to do is adding a lot of lighting. There's not really any light around here so when it gets dark, it's pretty dark. Um, but that's pretty much all and maybe a few more trees but I ran out of leaves so I didn't do that. Right now we've got a mixture of leaves and things. We're looking pretty cool. We've got some cool different trees around here. And you know, I'm quite happy with the way it came out. So we've got this path here. Need you to hear, I will need to remove this. This has got some junk in it and one pretty much broken axe that I could have repaired, but I've got a new one instead. Um, and then we can head over to here where we, you know, we uh, have our farm mostly for aesthetic purposes at this point. Uh, it does have carpet of water in there, as you can see there, to keep the crops growing. Uh, but I do want to build a nice beehive this episode with a really cool, um, or just a beehive that can help me power, you know, help the, the increase growth of crops. Um, so that's going to be something I'm going to look forward to. I have silk touch on something, I think. No, I don't. I just have fortune three on my axe as well. I basically have the same enchantments on these. So I need to get silk touch. I've got power free, I'm breaking free. I'm pretty sure my broken axe didn't even have that good enchantments on it, did it? Where's my cross egg? Oh, efficiency four, yep, yeah, there you go. So. We're going to struggle for this. I think I'm just going to need to go get books. Um, I'm going to have to Google, really. Is it worth enchanting? I, I still got this gold helmet on. I can't remember where I put my diamond helmet. I've lost it. Um, I put stuff everywhere. And I've got no clue. It has a sheep farm going pretty well. Yeah, anyway, so I want to get a bee farm done, which we're probably going to start doing working towards next. I also need to go into the little storage area we have. This is just my temporary storage area for now. Um, and... We need to get these blaze rods and the sorted so we can fight the dragon at some point. We've got okay uh, armor. It's got fire protection free, unbreaking free fawns too. Unbreaking free protection four is good on this one. Depth strider and unbreaking free. So that's not too bad. The armor, I do need protection, I think, for the boss. Take less damage, or I'm not really sure. I'll have to Google it for the best kind of outcome. Um, I'm not too down for the enchantment. I'm not really like an enchantment person. I don't really understand. Well, I understand them, I just don't really know what's best for what situation and right now as we're playing hardcore I kind of want to actually get a blast protection uh, pit as a whole kind of whole set because creepers are probably going to be my worst ally um, during this just because they like to sneak up on you explode I've got loads of sheep uh, cows here not sheep I've got two in there I kind of want to transport them um, I also can't wait for the new update because god damn I put everything out of wood it gets struck by lightning I've had two buildings struck by lightning I've had this one and I've had the, 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 the one at the back and do you know what? it's so annoying to rebuild them I'm not happy about it at all but yeah what I'm going to do now is get on with creating or finding uh, stuff to create a bee farm and once I found the stuff I might uh, do a little time lapse of me building it I'm not sure where I'm going to build it yet somewhere around here and we can get ahead with that and hopefully we get a nice little bee farm up and running gives us a loads of food so right now we're living off 
the cow farm up there and it's not really I'm not really making the most of it uh, we do have a chicken coop actually I don't know how well it's going but I need to refunnel it I've got so many jobs to do god damn it I need to get iron as well I've got quite a bit in here just from mining but I need more so I'm gonna have to put an iron farm of villages at some point too uh, I could put it on the board but yes anyway what I'm gonna do now is just gather up res some resources to create a nice little bee like beehive type farm area uh, sanctuary type thing and uh, yeah, I'll see you guys in a bit. After about 40 minutes of building, we have finally completed the bee sanctuary. It's looking pretty nice. It's a build that I've used before. Uh, I didn't have the stained glass though. I just used normal glass for this one. And all I need to do now is link some paths up to it, um, which won't too, take too long. One from here to probably over here. Then maybe we get one that links back around over here. Um, that's got to be linked up and all complete. I had a little uh, encounter of a creeper over there while I was farming sand earlier as well. Thought I was going to die. Thankfully, it all went, uh, it all went okay. Um, but yes, I need to just kind of decorate the place. We're looking pretty nice and uh, I'm not really sure what to do from here after this point We should probably really check the board uh, and see what we've got going on here. Um, so let's have a quick look at this board So on the board we've got collect to create a beehive. Well, I've just, just done that. I just need to collect the bees um, That scared me um, Collect villages for trades build a defense wall. Uh, the defense wall may take a while as I just want to get like a giant place first um, But yeah, we're looking pretty cool Everything's looking pretty good. Um, I've just realised like three of the houses I've built are facing the same way. Bad idea, I guess. Um, but the place where I wanted to keep this is looking pretty cool. So all is good. Um, the bee sanctuary looks very nice and I'm liking it. Put it near the farm area. And uh, yeah, it's very cool. So hopefully uh, we can get some more birds like that done. I want to beat the ender dragon at some point. Uh, got some meh armour. Kind of need to upgrade that. Um, a lot of things to do. And uh, not really sure where to go from here. But I'm probably going to jump cut for me doing something interesting as right now I'm going to take a break and then I'll probably jump back into the game and uh, begin my little journey again and um, we'll find some more cool stuff to do. So I'll probably see you guys in the next clip. So I'm actually just looking around for some bees and I have just spotted a beehive just over here. Um, right there but I haven't seen any bees go in or out of it yet uh, but I have recently probably seen it for about a couple of seconds so that probably would be why I'm not sure if there's anything in it and uh, I don't see anything nearby now my only guess would be to destroy this uh, but I don't have a campfire so uh, they're gonna be mad like, I think they'd be mad anyway if I destroy it I think that's my best bet there's, there's not even anything in it oh that sucks I need some bees to go back to my house Ah, I'm gonna have to look for some more. Oh, I've fallen. Uh, it's actually getting night time as well, which is not the best, um, I'll admit. There should be bees around here somewhere. This is a nice big forest over here. I don't think I even have a bed on me. Nope, I don't. Uh, what is that? Just a bush. Um, I'm, gonna, I'm gonna run back to the base. It's just over there. Um, and, and I'll let you know when I find more bees. 
or I'll find some bees because I haven't even found two yet or one. Um, I preferably want two so I can just breed and then I don't have to worry. But yeah, I'm going to run back, quickly grab some, uh, oh, not grab some, not grab anything, just sleep. It's, uh, begin, begin to get night time. So yeah, I'll see you in a second. Oh, I've stumbled across one bee. Now I've got to find more. Uh, must be a beehive around here somewhere for him to be there. Uh, maybe we could follow him. I don't know if it's going to be back or it. Uh, where could a beehive be around here? Literally anywhere. Um, B, could you please take me back to your your humble abode? Nope, you're just going to fly away from me. That's great. Uh, is that there? Did I just see it here? I did see it here. But there's only one B. And I want more than one B. Now... Oh, they're, they're here, they're here. We're sorted. Sorted. One here. Can we put these on leads? Is that a thing we can do? Yes, we can. Ah, awesome. Cool. Now I just gotta get this one up here. Right, come with me, Mr. B. Oh, so many trees in my way. Oh, come back here. Oh, I've got no sprint left. Jesus Christ, I need to get a lot of food. Once again, this bee is just getting away from me. I've lost it. Right, oh, nope, that's my one. Where did the bee go? Oh, he's there. Go him. Cool, let's let's just get out of here with the bees. Uh, take them back to my house. If I can make it that far without losing them, uh, would be good. It's a bit of a journey. I'm going to try my best not to lose them, and hopefully because they're kind of quite easy to pull along. Uh, as long as we stay above the trees, I don't reckon they're going to get stuck. Um, so we can just kind of make a path along here. I thought we already lost one then. Nope, we're all good. I can kind of go home with this. It's all good. Hopefully I can walk around like this. And uh, won't have too many problems here. So we've still got two. I'm going to try and get them back to the house. Just pulling them in now and sorted. They are in the house. And there we are. We can leave them in there. I think we'll be good. Uh, I just need to get some crops down in here. And I think that's all. Um, leave these guys to kind of fly around. I don't actually remember how to breed them or to make a beehive So that's gonna be fun. I'm not sure what I need to get those uh, Gonna have to do a bit of research. I guess yeah, I, I don't know the crafting recipe for a normal beehive Plus I don't have any wood on me and I'm starving to death. So it's been a shambles <laughs> I have so much uh, Building done but lack of food is pretty high um, There's actually a nice place to cook over here so yes, I need to actually get get ahead on the cooking, get loads of food cooked and kind of sort myself out because otherwise I'm going to begin struggling and it's going to get worse from here onwards. Um, I do need to kind of make a proper source of food, constant food, the chicken coop thing, I'm not sure how well that's doing. I'm going to go check on that in a minute. Uh, I just need to heal up first. So let's take some steak and heal up a bit and some pork. That should heal me up just for a minute while I go check on this. And hopefully everything will be cool and dandy and good. And yeah, the chickens died in here due to the fire. But it's okay, I've still got chickens down here in the, the chicken coop thing. Uh, it's got six cooked chicken. Oh, wait, I mean, it's not the most efficient thing. I might need to put some, might need to feed them a bit more. Maybe that's what I'm going to do, breed some. Oh, there goes my uh, blocks that I kind of needed. It's fine, I'll use some coarse dirt for now. And let's move our way in here. Yep, there they are. And then just get some seeds. And we can breed these guys. Like so. Come on, where are you all? I can't reach all of you, I can only reach some of you. It's fine. Uh, and I'll just fill this back up. Like so. And um, up we go. The only issue is I'm using coarse dirt. Give me normal dirt. Why have I got a cobblestone block? Okay, there, there. Oh, we're just breaking everything. That's cool. Got a bit of food from that. It's not a massive way of gaining food, but it gives better. Well, it gives you know at least some over what I'm kind of currently dealing with. My food situation is poor, um, so it might be worth just AFKing and letting that do its thing. Right now, I'm just dropping everything on the floor. Um, yeah, let's go back to the house. I should probably organise my chests, and um, I'm not really sure. I'm not really sure. Look how messy this is. I'm actually going to do, do a bit of organising, and I won't put you guys through the pain of that. 
Now, I haven't cleaned out all of my inventory, I will admit that one. I cleaned out some of it, uh, not a lot, um, completely at all, to be honest. I just really, really didn't think about cleaning it all out. I was going to, and then I really just couldn't be bothered. I need to make an automated sorting system, but I just wanted to come over to the board before I end this episode, and, uh, remove this one right here, as we've now done that. So, Plantasaurus. We have completed the beehive slash house and collected the bees too. So that is now gone. Uh, if any of you guys want to add to this board, feel free to leave a comment below and I can add some more to this board. For now, we've got to collect villages for trades and build a, a defense wall. And uh, yeah, I'm happy with the beehive. We'll quickly run over there now and uh, take one more last look at it. I just need to kind of decorate the area and add a path to it. Um, apart from that, it is looking good. Add some uh, inside. We need to actually get a hoe and add some... Um, crops to it as well, some seeds, uh, I left some in here by accident, and yeah, hopefully, oh, it's getting night time, that's not good, hopefully that'll be uh, all done by next episode, and hopefully, well, I could even get it done before next episode, and uh, we can enjoy a nice look at that, and hopefully make it a, you know, usable, efficient little thing, um, little bee sanctuary, and uh, yeah, hopefully you guys enjoyed this series so far, if you are, please leave a comment, like, and subscribe, and I'll see you all soon, peace.